Hi guys. Um, I had to start this video over because my crazy brothers. Um, anyway, um, we just got back from church and we're getting ready to head over to our grandparents. But I wanted to hop on here and welcome you to today's video. And I'm wearing short sleeves. Um, and anyway, I hope that you're having a good day and um, welcome to today's video. All right, so we're taking advantage of this very nice warm day. I'm going for a walk. My grandpa's living a good development to walk in, so that's what we're gonna do. And uh, I, I feel like all your vlogs. Are like, <laughs> I feel like all my videos walk. lately. I feel like all my, my my videos lately have just been us walking. But you know, that's because that's the only thing we do around here, I guess, is go walking. But. Uh, yeah, let's okay guys, I don't know if you can see it, but Elijah is riding Gabriel's bike. We love this place. I think it's a cornfield. I think this is tied with chocolate. Hey boys, I don't think you should be walking like that. I mean, it was a dumb answer to a dumb question. We should go that way and go to the next cool stop. Just walk in the field? Yeah. <laughs> are we should be doing this right now? They're gonna wonder where we are. I'm not even sure we're currently supposed to be walking in here. But I mean we're on the edge. And we're walking to the next cold attack, so it's I don't think they're gonna like that. Let's go. We'll just go to the other cul-de-sac in order to close them. Because, you know, it's still muddy and there's still like corn on the ground and we just probably shouldn't do it. So we're gonna. <laughs> what are the boys doing? We can leave them there. <laughs> we'll just go. My mom, my mom and grandmother are like all the way up ahead anyway, so they're probably. I don't, I don't even think they've noticed that we're not behind them. Because they're busy talking, so. I'm just glad today is such a nice day. I'm just so glad today is such a nice day. The boys are still in the field. You yeah. know what? It's really okay. Four of them are fine by themselves. They're really fine. This was a family party of eight. Now it's two, two, and four. So... I mean, the best two are together, though. So. Obviously. Once again, it's just the two of us. I feel like the videos are just always the two of us. It's because we're such good sisters. <laughs> you know, like, we've always... I feel like we weren't always close, but now we've gotten a lot closer. Now that we're older, we can't fight over clothes. Well... I mean, we still can. But they like, tell you, you know, that, like, when you're two and six, or, like, no, like, you're six and ten, or, like, ten and fourteen, it's really, really a big deal. But when you're sixteen and twenty, not that big of a deal. I'm not 16 and 20 yet, but we will be this year. I'll be 20, so we'll be 16. Yikes, I can die. Like four years ago. Well, watch out. We like fall all the time when we're like really stupid stuff. And now, now we're like, oh, well. I still get mad at her just because. I'm a messy person. And I'm not. And that bothers me. But other than that, the boys are trying to catch up to us. I don't know if you can see them back there. They're probably wondering. I, I don't think my mom has even noticed that we're no longer behind her. Like, I just don't think she's noticed anymore. But, guys, look at that gigantic dirt pile. This house is the last is the last house to be built with development because it's the last free lot. But look at that gigantic dirt pile. I would just... That's freaking huge. The party is even more split up now. Say hi, Joe. Hi. The older boys went home. I'm still here. And there's the three of us, and then it's Gabe and my mom yo look you can see the new middle school from here hey, the new hey, elementary hey, school hey, from here hey. so well okay hey. this field i'll show you guys our favorite spot when summertime uh, uh, yeah in the development look at the plane. in our in the summertime Wait, we come the here new, is that the new yeah no, that's the new that that's yellow, new elementary school right there building? a big yellow building do you remember the post those pictures that we took here 
Oh yeah, I just took a hook from them. We have a whole bunch of pictures from this day, but like there was actually like green stuff and corn, and now it's just cornfield. But this is like our favorite it spot. It looked like Hawaii. Yeah. I know it did. It looked like Hawaii, not any. Yeah, we need legit pictures that look like we're in Hawaii, but um, <laughs> obviously doesn't look like Hawaii right I now. I have an issue. I always do this. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't look like Hawaii anymore. No. Nope. My free time. I don't know what to do with my arms. I'm just gonna do this. Woo! Yeah, but not Hawaii. Guys, I have a question that Grace wants you to answer. Um, do I? should she cut her hair <laughs> like short? That's very random. I say I no. I say no. Well, she, she keeps I like talking her hair. about it. Although I don't think your comments are turned on. No. See, here's the thing. I like my hair long the way it is, but two years ago beginning of the summer got my hair cut to like i don't know like maybe like here like right below the shoulder blade mine was like here i'm i really like that too so but when your hair is longer you can do more things with it than when it's shorter so right now i'm kind of like i don't know do i want to cut it or not if i do cut it i'm gonna wait till like the end of may or something probably to get a cut but i'm chopping all my hair off to like my shoulder collarbones mm -hmm. that's a shoulder bone but um or my shoulders but i have i'm waiting for it to grow long because i want to donate it and right yeah. now it's like it's long like it's not that long so yeah anyway yep that's the great hair problems <laughs> yeah I, mean, I feel like if you can donate your hair you should because like yeah, yeah cancer and everything <laughs> That has my that one has friend always wanted my one friend always wanted me to donate my hair when I was younger because she donated her hair several times and her hair is kind of like mine like a similar it's curly like mine actually her hair is even curlier than mine shout out to Aliana <laughs> shout out to Aliana if you ever watched this but um yeah um I never like she always wanted me to do it and I never I never did it so now I'm like hmm maybe I will do it so we'll see Guys, see that silhouette? That's as far as it's gonna go. Well, the other one, I just thought those were real bare ones. Thank Can't you say I blame them. Looks kind of real to me. Yep. Especially like when you're riding a bike, because me and Peter were riding yeah. a bike one. But I thought it was a real bear, and then we went home, and everyone got in the car, <laughs> and we went to go check it out, but it was not a suit. It was not. I decided to go out again. Because my mom and grandmother left in loop. And I'm trying to find them, but I don't know where they would be out here. Because, you know, there's lots of places they could be. I don't know which direction they went. So I'm walking the opposite direction in hopes that I find them. But I might not find them, but even if I don't find them, I'm like, I take a walk outside in nature by myself and have fun doing it. So I'm going to see if I can find them. But. So, oh. I just don't want to be inside. It's kind of like, it's so nice. In the next couple days, like, it's, I think it's supposed to be warmer tomorrow, but I think it's supposed to be a little rainy. Not super nice, so I'm like, okay. I need to be nice out. But, okay. yeah, I'm stopped. So, I'm back home, and I never did catch them, but I, it was nice. I had a nice walk by myself and I was listening to some worship music, casting crowns for the win, and uh, it was good. It was relaxing. And now Lydia and I are going to hang out in our favorite room of the house, this in room, and uh, work on some work. So that's just where we will be for the next, I don't know, hour or so. But I'm a hoodlum. Leave me alone. Don't talk to me. Stop, but he's I'm mad in life right now. Why? Because I am. Because you call me weird. I call a lot of people weird. I'm weird by <laughs> so <laughs> Yeah. You want to see? You want to see what these people made me do? I had five <laughs> chocolate. No. She says we're gonna make her fat. <laughs> Cause they're, because this was comfort food because I felt bad for myself because they made me feel bad about myself. So I had comfort food. 
They're not owning it because they know it's true. Picking it down. I mean, picking. picking They're not owning it because they know it's true. It's not even true. We didn't even say anything that could have made anyone feel better. Like, we're not saying anything wrong. And also, that snort, they made me snort too. That was an involuntary, an involuntary snort. That's gonna make you look more weird. Let me get somebody texting me telling you how wonderful you are. Uh. <laughs> Apologizing for being a jerk. Yeah, he was a big jerk to me today. Mike, if you're watching this, I'm mad at you. Mike, I hope you watch this and just see, like, feel so bad. You're just like, you were a jerk today, and it really hurt my feelings. Made me mad. Okay, what does he give you a hug for you last Mike? You yeah, I, because I was friend. mad at him. He was trying to love punch me, and then when I said it wasn't funny, he tried to love, love punch me again. Mike? I was like, what, you don't like love punching? Blah, blah, blah. Mike. But he's like, have you ever heard of love punching? I'm looking at him like, what are you talking about? Mike, Sharon. if you're watching this, um, you're Grace's friend, not her brother. That's all. Goodbye. <sighs> I think what she meant to say is don't be a jerk to me. Okay? Okay. There. Um, Good, we got that cleared up. So, it's the next morning. And yes, I put on the same clothes I wore yesterday after church because they weren't dirty. Um, so, yeah. Um, this morning, our giant tree in our backyard is getting cut down. And so, they're here right now. I don't think you can hear it from inside, but they are, and it's kind of crazy. Anyway, um, just wanted to hop on here and say good morning. Let's just appreciate. I have my Phillies purse, and I have my Lanes of Phillies. I'm wearing a Philly shirt. I have a Philly sweatshirt right here, and that's not that's not even half of my Philly stuff. We're cutting down the tree. Next time I show you our backyard. Next time I show you my backyard, there ain't gonna be a tree. Craziness. But um that trees I guess had to come down for like last time they came and trimmed it, they're like, oh, I was gonna come down within the next within the next five years. I think it's three years later, three or four years later. I think we came the spring of 2016. Yeah, that makes sense. Since that was the first spring we were here. But, uh, yeah, so down goes our tree. It's gonna be different, but I think it'll be good. Kind of different, not having, having this big open space in our backyard, but it'll probably be fun. Anyway, so that's what's happening today in our house. I just got home. And look at that. That is the progress of the tree. It's so sad. This tree, we gotta say goodbye to our tree and it's kinda sad. It's low key kinda depressing. Um, but that being said, we don't want it to fall in the house. So I guess it's a good thing it's going, but it is still kinda sad that it has to go. But um, when they're completely done, I will go out and show you um, what the tree looks like. I'll go out and show you everything and then I'll put that right after this clip. So, uh, but yeah, that's the progress of the tree right now. Here is the, okay, no, wait, look. There's the tree stump. There's the pile of logs. They're gonna come back. Oh, wait, you don't have socks on, stay here. You don't, I mean, you don't have shoes on, stay here. They're gonna come back and take the stump out, but I'm standing on the tree stump. That's crazy. I mean, and look at all this sawdust. There was sawdust on my car. And then, pile of logs. That's a lot. Anyway, I told you I was gonna show you all the tree. Come here, Joe. So, Whoa! 
I told you I was gonna show you the treat, so that's what we're gonna do. Yeah. And uh, with that being said, we're gonna wrap up this video here. Mm -hmm. um, I hope that you enjoyed watching our tree go. It's really, really, really like our backyard is all of a sudden spacious and like so roomy. Yeah. And it's gonna take a little bit to get used to. Yep. But it's gonna be fun. Yeah. But we anyway. could hear it this morning when we were walking to school. We could hear the song go like. Yeah, yeah we can hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, with that, we're going to end this video here. So see yeah. you guys next time. Bye. Bye.